with Disney developing multiple projects based on Star Wars, a brand new rumor suggests that Hayden Christensen will be returning in live action to once again play the role of Anakin Skywalker, and it will be in the upcoming Obi-Wan Kenobi series on Disney+. Plus. So we've known for a while, much like every other series, that Kenobi had to get bumped back. And we knew that right before they were about to finalize some of the ideas, they decided to scrap what they had and start rewriting it because it was a little too close to what they were doing with The Mandalorian. Now these latest rumors are suggesting that we're going to go into a different style of story. One that we'll see Hayden Christensen brought back to replace his role as Anakin Skywalker along alongside Obi-Wan Kenobi. Now while we don't have any details on how this is going to be, LRM Online claims that he's going to actually be a regular on the show, which would obviously mean that he's going to have a pretty substantial role if he's a regular. And according to them, the announcement was going to be made at Celebration 2020, but since that got delayed, of course, this isn't the case anymore. Now, if he is coming back, I think this would probably mean that maybe there's going to be flashback, possibly tying it into Clone Wars or maybe some of the other events throughout their history. They could, of course, use de-aging technology if they wanted to. Or it could be a way where Obi-Wan is maybe haunted by his past because he thinks Anakin is dead and he caused the downfall of the whole Jedi Order. Sort of like a P. TSD scenario which I could see playing really well into this and why Obi-Wan is really trying to stay away from everything but realistically I think you know it's probably going to be a mixture of both a few flashbacks maybe exploring some of the details around episode 3 fill in some of the gaps in episode 3 because there is a substantial amount of time that passes in that film and like I said more than likely some sort of personal closure for Obi-Wan and now let's just get this out of the way it's obviously he can't appear as Darth Vader because that wouldn't make sense, that would contradict Star Wars and New Hope. So it has to be some sort of flashbacks or some sort of force thing, vision, side thing, I don't know, whatever they're going to do. They, they always tend to introduce these uh, new elements of the force with the Disney canon. But whatever it is, I think fans will be excited and uh, hopefully, you know, this ends up being true because that'll be pretty awesome. So what do you guys think about this and what direction do you think they go with? Um, hopefully, you know... It is flashbacks because I would love to see some scenes from the Clone Wars redone in live action because that would just be awesome. And who knows what other cameos they could toss in there as well. You know, maybe set some of these flashbacks between episode two and three. That would be really cool. Like that's, that's a lot of good stuff you can have in there.